Hi there, you're watching Beyond World is One. My name is Isha Hanspal. Let's begin this broadcast with our top stories in our headlines. Army deployed in Pakistan capital to ensure security as jailed former Prime Minister Imran Khan's party goes ahead with protest plans. The troops should remain in the city till October 17th to maintain law and order for upcoming SCO summit. The FBI warns of a threat of violence ahead of the anniversary of the October 7th attacks on Israel as it could be motivating factor for violent extremists and hate crime perpetrators to threaten public safety. Palestinian militant group Hamas says an Israeli strike on a refugee camp in North Lebanon killed its commander Saeed Atala Ali and his family. The strike hit the Badawi camp near the northern city of Tripoli. Five rockets launched from Lebanon at northern Israel, setting off sirens in many towns in Jezreel Valley, Wadi Ara area and Nazareth. The IDF says some of the rockets were intercepted while the rest impacted open areas. And reports quoting Swedish police source claim Iran enlisted criminals to carry out armed attacks on Israeli embassies in Stockholm and Copenhagen last Monday and Wednesday. Two Swedish teenagers were arrested for the attacks. India's National Investigation Agency conducts raids at 22 locations in a case related to activities of Jesh-e Mohammed terror outfit group. The raids are being carried out in Jammu and Kashmir, Maharashtra, Uttar Pradesh, Assam and Delhi. Fire breaks out at an electric bike factory in northern Vietnam, raising 3,000 vehicles in Lang Song province. The blaze started from a comp component storage before spreading to other parts of the factory. For all the latest news, download the Weon app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.